Morning children, are you ready for another phonics lesson? Great, do you have your paper ready and a pencil? Okay, remember, put it down, we don't need it at the moment. Okay, this morning we're going to start with listening skills, okay? So we're going to practice our listening. So you need to listen really carefully and I'm going to give you some instructions and I need you to follow those instructions. But I'm going to sound talk some of the words. Are you ready? Let's give it a try. Here we go. Put your ing er on your n o's. I'm going to say it again. Put your ing er on your n o's. What did I say? Put your finger on your nose. Are you doing it? Great. Let's try another one. Place your h a n d s on your h a n d. Place your h a n d s on your h a n d. Did you get it? Place your hands on your head. Great. Let's try another one. Can you flap your arms? Can you flap your arms? What did I say? Can you flap your arms? Like a bird. Brilliant. Okay, let's begin. We're going to start by revising all of our phonemes. So remember, I need to hear you saying them and look before you say it. Okay, here we go. Uh, x. Show me those tongues. Or it can be z, z, e, a, m, j. Ow. E. I. V. A. I. Ch. E. Wu. Ow. Y. Remember, it can be E at the end of a word, like silly, jolly, you, or it can be oo, z, or a, sh, r, a, o, o. Ooh, or it can be uh. Oi. Or. O. Ear. You, or it can be oo. Er. Oi. Air. E. Your. You, or it can be oo, or I, er. Mm. So today, children, what we're going to be doing, we are looking at another alternative grapheme for the sound er. And today, it's spelt I, R. So it's making the same sound as our other er that we, or two er's that we learned last week, but it's spelt differently. I, R, er. Can you say it? Er. Fantastic. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do, we are going to sound and blend some words with our new er diagraph in. Remember, 
I need to hear you sound talking them to me, okay? And I'm go you're going to sound talk them when I press the sound buttons. Here we go. G, uh, ooh. Go. Well done. S, uh, so. You have a go. Great. Here we go. B, uh, d, bird. See if you can do this one on your own. I'll do it with you. Here we go. Sh, uh, t, shirt. Great. Here we go. Sk, uh, t, skirt. You do it. Well done. Not sure I can hear you. B, uh, bird. Remember to blend those sounds at the end so you get the whole word. Here we go. You try this one. I'll do it with you. Third. Third. I came third in the running race. Ready? First. First. Did you come first in your race? Let's try this one. Oh, it's quite a long one. Should we break this up? Let's try it. Th, uh, th, in, teen, thirteen, thirteen. See if you can try it on your own. Thirteen, well done. Let's try this one. Thirst e. Thirsty. And there's that y at the end, making that e sound. Let's try that one again. You do it. Great. Try this one. Brilliant, girl. You did them really, really well. Okay, so what we're going to do now, you need your pencil and your paper. Hope you're sitting nice and comfortably. And you are going to write for me the digraph er. Uh. Remember, if you look at the letters, they're the same height, aren't they? We're going to write er. Uh. What sound button are you going to put underneath it? That's right, you're going to put one of our sausages. Absolutely, it's a digraph. It's two letters making one sound. See if you can do it. Write the digraph er uh, for me. Leave a space. And can you write me the digraph er uh, again? Remember, sound talk it to your paper as you're, as you're writing it. Er. Uh. Don't forget the sound button. Leave a space. And write me the digraph er uh, again. Brilliant. Okay, so now you've written the digraph er, uh, I'm going to say some words and you're going to sound talk them back to me and then you're going to write them down. Okay, let me get my pen and my board to help. Okay, so remember we're going to count the phonemes with our phonic fingers. Okay, and the first word is sir. Sir. Uh, sir. See if you can write it down. Sir. Remember to sound button it afterwards to check it. Here we go. S uh. S uh. Sir. If you got it right, give it a tick. Let's do the next one. Now, if you can write sir, you can also write the word Stir. Listen carefully. Stir. 
Get sound talking. S-t, uh, stir. Did you hear that? Let's try it again. Stir. S-t, uh, stir. See if you can write it down. Remember, sound talk it as you're writing it. Stir. I'm going to have a go. S-t, uh, Sound button it to check it. St, uh, stir. Give it a tick. Great. Let's do another one. Go. Go. You ready to sound talk it? Go. G. Uh. Ooh. Go. See if you can have a go at writing it. Go. I'm going to have a go. G. Uh. Ooh. G. Uh. Ooh. Go. Well done. You ready for another one? Okay, listening carefully, remember? Show me your phonic fingers. Shirt. Shirt. I am wearing a shirt today. Shirt. Let's sound talk it. Sh. Uh. T. Shirt. Okay, go and sound talk it to your paper. See if you can write it down for me. Shirt. Sh. Uh. T. Remember to check it with your sound buttons. Sh. Uh. Shirt. Great. Give it a tick. Don't worry if you got it wrong. Copy it down if you want to. Remember, sound talk it as you're writing it. Okay, let's try the next one. Show me those funny fingers. Here we go. I can hear a bird singing. Bird. Here we go. B -d bird. Brilliant. Make sure you get those bit that B and D the right way round. Bird. Okay, I'm gonna try it. B. Uh, d. B. Uh, d. Bird. Well done. Remember to check that your B and your D are the right way round. Okay, let's try another one. Mrs. Goodwin came third in her race. Third. Let's sound talk it. Third. Third. Now, can you hear what's at the beginning? What digraph do we have? Remember, I'm showing my tongue. So it's third. Third. Have a go. Third. I'm not sure I can hear you all sound talking it to your paper. Okay, let's try it. Ready? Uh, d. Uh, d. Third. If you haven't got it right, don't worry. Write it down now. Third. Third. Well done. Okay, let's try another one. Are you ready? Here we go. Listen carefully. Twirl. Twirl. Can you twirl around for me? Twirl. Here we go. T -w -uh -oo. Twirl. It's got four phonemes. Sound talking to me again. Well done. See if you can sound talk it to your paper now. Twirl. I'm going to have a go. T uh, ooh. 
I'm going to say I'm buttoning it to check it. T oh. Twirl. Oh, you're getting really good at this now. Well done. Okay, pop your pencil down and we are going to look at the screen. Okay, let's read what it says at the top. Can you read the sentences? Let's have a look. Here we go. Have a go at reading it your, uh, on your own, first of all. I'm going to read it with you now. Let's try it. Here we go. Can you, oh, can you remember what digraph this is? E, that's right. Clean, clean the dirt. E, dirty shirt. Sh shirt. First, first. Oh, we've got the e digraph again. Please, please remember. We don't sound talk that at the end, do we? Okay, let's read it again. This time I'm going to try not to sound talk it and remember the words. Okay, here we go. Can you clean the dirty shirt first, please? Did you get it? Brilliant. If not, don't worry. Use your sounds, sound talk it out. And remember, if you're sound talking a sense, um, some words in a sentence, give it another read afterwards. Try and remember the word that you've sound talked. Should we do another one? Here we go. Okay, have a read on your own first. See if you can see, uh, read it. Use your sounds to sound talk any word you're not sure of. I'm going to read it with you now. Here we go. The girl, girl will be a thirteen, teen, thirteen on her next, next, oh, long word, let's break it up, birthday, day, birthday. Day. Birthday. Did you get it? Let's read it again. The girl will be 13 on her next birthday. Well done. Fantastic reading from all of you. That's great. Okay, we are going to be looking at some high frequency words. Now, I have changed some of these. Some of them are the same. Okay, let's see if you can spot them. Are you ready? Say the, say the word to me. His. With. With, it's using that digraph where we need to see our tongues. With. I'm going to hide it. See if you can write it for me. With. Five, four, three, two, one. Did you get it right? Great. Okay, let's carry on. Will. Him. That. My. Do you think you can write my? I'm going to hide it. My. Five, four, three, two, one. Did you get it right? Okay. Cover it up. See if you can write it again. My. Did you do it? Brilliant. Let's carry on. You. He. Had. Was. Well done. An. She. All. I wonder if you can write that word. All. I'm going to hide it. It's a tricky one. All. Okay, let's see if you've done it. K. 
Okay, cover it up. See if you can write all, all. Did you get it right? Give it a tick. Let's carry on. C, not, then. Remember, it's got that, we need to see those, um, that tongue, then. See if you can write me the word, then. I'm going to hide it. There it goes, then. Five, four, three, two, one. Then. Great. I'm going to hide it again. Cover it, your one up, and see if you can write it again for me. Then. Did you get it right? Brilliant. Let's carry on. They. Well done. Down. Down. Let's see if you can write it down. Can you write down? I'm hiding it. Down. Five, four, three, two, one. Did you get it right? Is your D around the right way? If not, copy it now. Down. See if you can cover your one up and write me the word down again. Down. Give it a tick if you got it right. If you didn't, don't worry, you can practice another time. Well done. Another fantastic phonics lesson from all of you. You are all working so hard. Give yourself a marshmallow clap. Okay, well done. And I will see you tomorrow. Keep working hard and be the best you can be. See you tomorrow, bye bye.